As a boy, my people's homes were burned to ash because we dared to call God by another name. Then, my people hunted me. You build robots to hunt us, callers to chain our power. Humanity must protect itself. Protection? That is extermination! Will humanity undo Genosha? Old friend, you should have seen it. It was just as you said that day in the bar. A promise was made. A promise? Hab keine Axt. I promised a boy a future free of fear, only to watch his frightened eyes be vaporized inside his tiny skull. Because he believed in me. In the dream you had me sell. Where we simper like beggars for tolerance. They shall be avenged! We are left with but two choices. Cling to this dying world. Or rise to your future and look down upon this fallen pigsty planet. This is your dream. My kind splayed before you, powerless and afraid. We are not gods, Magnus. Gods abandon those who believe in them. Mutants do not. Behold the reward. What? Must we do to be good enough? I have only ever acted to avenge crimes against my people. Is this the High Road's destination? If so, I say as I have too many times before. Never again. Pain, grief. That most of us experience tragedies like Genosha as a bit of deja vu before getting on with our day. But the scariest thing about Genosha wasn't the death or the chaos. It was the thought. The only sane thought you can have when being chased by giant robots that were built to crush you. Magneto was right. If that were the case, are we truly to believe then that in the face of what you consider to be extermination, you would walk Charles Xavier's path? If indeed mutants exist, why wouldn't they use their abilities to make the world better for all people? There was a time I would smite you all for what was done to Storm. Xavier knew this and dreamed we could change, find harmony. What if I were? Run and hide before someone starts dreaming of camps. Today, I have saved you from your own. For an old friend has challenged me to remember this view of Earth. A future where human and mutant could relinquish the past and finally... <sighs> you claim justice is overdue. Indeed. But so is he that help them cherish their gifts. Help the world see all we share by, by being different. Charles Xavier entrusted me with his dream. And it does not ask you to love or embrace my kind as your own. Heed what happened when my village used reason while others used tanks. Charles. I would always sense Charles in my mind. Not invading or a presence. I was in his thoughts and he in mine. To accept that this is a shared world with a common future and that my kind like yours, have the right to live in it.
were worried if you still felt how much he loved you. You wouldn't be able to go through this with Crusade. I am trying to be better. We shall not live our days wondering if we could have saved more. The men gathered on a knee. Remember, would we be here helping the survivors who cared about staying alive?